not, not, not follow anybody else. We got a lot of folk that we want to follow. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 You look at various programs, religious shows on, on, on our television, you know, and you've already labeled a good preacher. You said, well, I want to follow him. Uh, because he's truly preaching the gospel. Mm -hmm. Amen. But God said what we got to learn to do is not put anybody else before him. We got to follow him. Yes, sir. Yeah. Amen. And if you follow him, you will find out that serving God will come easy. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. It's only that you have a hard time when you try to mix it up. Glory. Yeah. Hey, come on. When we try to serve God, Mammon and God too. Oh, yeah. God said you can only serve one. You can't serve money and, and then serve God also. Yes. You got to have, you got to love the one and you, or, or hate the other. Or hate the other and love the other one. Yes, so, so, so you got, if you, if you love something else more than you do God, you are serving that particular thing. Yes. 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 Who am I preaching to here? Bless you. Come on now. Yet we want to say that we're on our way to heaven because I, I'm serving God, but yet you don't put a time limit on serving God. You're saying that I'm, I'm serving God, but I'll be glad when I get out. But then, no, there's something that, that you're mixing in with serving God. You got to be a follower of Christ. You got to be a doer of the word. Amen. If you're following him, then you got to do what the word say do. Yeah. Amen. Amen. So then, so then, it's not how many hours you put in, and now I'm talking about the ten. That, that, that's why. That's why we're not happy with, uh, the way we ought to be. That's why it seems like it's an effort to serve God is because you're not surrendering nothing. Yes, sir. To serve God, you got to give of yourself. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. Now, I've never been in the, in, the, in the armed forces, but when you're going there, you're talking about you're serving your country. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. But you, some of them are not serving it willingly. Amen. You, you, you're under a command to do nothing so. Mm -hmm. Amen. God does not put you on a command. you got to do it willingly. Yes, if you want to serve God, you got to give him of your heart. Want to do it, even even what, whatever price that it costs, I'm going to do this. Yes, sir. Thank you, Lord. I'm going to surrender my all. I will to Christ. Amen. Amen. It's not. It's not. It's not what what's in your home because you know what I what I've learned that when you get to glory, all you're going to want to do is praise Him. All you're going to want to do is say glory, hallelujah. Yes, sir. We're going to praise him. Amen. No such thing as day and night in glory. Mm -hmm. But we're going to praise him with every breath that we have. Amen. Yes, thank Don't you want to serve God? Yes. yes. Amen. 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 You know, I'm, I'm wondering sometimes, I, I've been uh, preaching for over 60 years. Now, if I go back ten more years, I've been preach, I've been serving God over seventy years. Yes, sir. Yeah. And I'm not tired yet, All right. no. because I know what, what 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 God has in store for me. I know that whatever I'm asking for, He will give it to me. Why? Because I I I, 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 I try to be the best servant that I can be. Amen. 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 Yes, sir. Listen, if any man serve me, let him follow me. And where I am, mm -hmm. yeah. huh? Yeah. There shall what? You be also my servant. There shall also my servant be. Uh -huh. But it's like where, where I am, there for therefore my, my servant is going to be there also. Yes, sir. Where I am, there you're going to be. Where, where, where are you now? If you're serving God, if you've accepted Christ as your personal Savior, you've given up the world. If you hate the world, uh, where are you going to be? you with Christ. Yes, sir. Where is Christ? He's seated on the right hand of the Father. Yes, sir. Forever living to make intercession for 
for us. Where are you? You're seated with him. Yes. Where? In the heavenly places. Amen. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you, Lord. <clears throat> I, I just heard the crowd singing, uh, 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 beginning cry singing. They were saying that, that, that never mind, they were saying something about being in back of the cross. Yes, sir. To the other side. The other, the other side, side of the cross. Yes, sir. That, that, that's where the joy begins. It does not begin in front of the cross. All of your trials and tribulations is in front of the cross, but back in the, it's, it's, it's on the other side of the cross, there should be joy, peace, and happiness. Other side. Glory. We try to stay on both sides. <laughs> yes, sir. Therefore, your joy is limited. You're still upholding a lot of stuff that the world got to offer. And we don't know, we can't handle it. We say, well, I, I'm in the world, I might as well. No, no, no. You're not of the world. You died to the things of the world. When you accepted Christ as personal Savior, when Christ died on the cross, and when he was buried, you were buried with him. Yes. Amen. And when you rose, you rose, you came up out of that dusty grave with him. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord. You know when he died, he went down. Yes, sir. To the lower part of the earth. Yes. Thank you, Lord. He had somebody there. Yes, sir. He had the old believers there yes, that didn't, didn't see this day that you see. Yes, sir. Amen. But they believed in him. Yes. They believed that he was on the way. Yes. yes. Amen. So he went down there to the lower part of the earth to take paradise from beneath. Yes, sir. And to bring his servant where he is. He went down there and he slayed death. He slayed, he slayed sin. Yes, sir. Amen. And victory Amen. all powers in his hands. Yes. Oh, so then if you are a servant of God, you ain't get, you don't have nothing to work. I know that in this world you're going to have trials, you're going to have some tribulation, but don't worry about it. Great is your reward in glory. Yes, sir. Yes, thank you, Lord. My, my, my. You are with me. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 And if you're with him, what you worried about? That's right. That's right. I, 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 I will tell my grandson, my grandson, uh, uh, Andre, he's uh, got a job working for Lock Key, and uh, the people kind of giving him a little hard way to go sometimes. Mm -hmm. They'll talk, you know, that they, they, some folks when they're jealous, they just lambast you. Mm -hmm. Yes. And I, I tell them, don't worry about it. That's right. I say, great is it, he in you than he that's in the world. Yes, sir. And when you know that, you know what? He says, in all things, acknowledge him, and he will direct your path. So don't just forget about what they're talking about and keep your eyes passed on him. Yes, sir. Amen. And he's going to work things out all right. Yes. Amen. Amen. See, first thing people got to learn is they don't know is what goes out of your mouth. You think that it's not going to come back, but, but it has a way of boomeranging on you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Right now. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. That's where I am. Mm. You're going to be there also. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. Where I am, there shall also my servant be. Mm -hmm. If any man serve me. Mm -hmm. Amen. Yeah. If any man serve me, him with what? Uh, With my Father honor. If any man serve me, him with my Father and honor. Yes. Yes, sir. Amen. You know if you serve Christ, you can ask anything. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. Yes, sir. God will honor you because you serve in his son. Yes. My Father will honor you. And you know what it is to be honored? Mean that God is going to hold you in high esteem, so you don't have nothing to worry about. All you got to do is keep the faith. Yes, sir. Come on now. But when you ask for something, Jesus is saying that if, if you 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 got to ask it in my name. Amen. My Father's going to give it to you, but you got to ask it in my name. Yes. And you not only ask it in my name, but you got to have the faith that I will give it to you. Yes. Lord. 
Tell them to ask God, but if you don't get it today or tomorrow, <laughs> you give up. <laughs> no, you gotta persevere. Right. You gotta persevere. Yes, sir. Oh, yes. Amen. Keep on now. That's yes. right. Keep on now. Keep on now. Keep on seeing. Yes, sir. Amen. Do you think I stand here? I, 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 I see everything happen instantly. No, you can't put this faith in a microwave. Yes, sir. Oh, no. <laughs> Your food is warm instantly. I don't like the microwave. <laughs> to me, the microwave dries out stuff. Yes, sir. Amen. Cook a pork chop, put it in the microwave, that thing goes tough. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Yes. I don't like microwave, but, but 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 listen. When I put my faith in God, I don't have to worry about it. I, 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 it's going to have substance when I get it. Yes, sir. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Amen. All you got to do is just wait. If you wait on the Lord, then what 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 I just say? You shall renew your strength. You should mount up on wings of eagles. You should run and not be weary. You should walk and not pray. Because I believe my God, he's going to honor me. Why? Because I want to be the best servant that I can be. Do I get tired sometimes? Yeah, I get tired sometimes. I tell the Lord, yes, I'm tired, Lord. You know, things are not going the way that I would like to see it go. I've been suffering for so many years, but I, when I heard
It's like it's like a person that first time you're getting on an airplane and they're taking a nice long breath flight and it's up 35,000 feet and, and the plane hits some turbulence. Uh -huh. Oh my God. <laughs> and also some air pockets. Right. And it drop and it seems like the plane is going to crash. Some people will curse. Mm. <laughs> Some people will praise the Lord. Yes. You beg then, Lord, if you just get me down safely, uh -huh. I'm going to serve you for the rest of my life. Yeah. I'm going to give half of my goods to the church. I know I haven't been tithing right. I should give more. I could give more. But I'm, I'm going to do a little better than what I've been doing. If you just get me on the ground safely this time and the plane will land. It's come down to giving on. The man reached in his pocket and pulled out his famous little $5 bill. And then he said, yes, Lord, I, I remember what I said, but I, you know, I have kind of changed the plans. If I fly again, then <laughs> I'm going to do my best. <laughs> if I get in this predicament again, Lord, then, then I'm going to really say God knew from the first time while you was up there. He knew that when you landed and when things start doing good, he knew that you still wasn't going to serve him. Yeah. Lord. Yeah. But he still bless you. Yeah. That's right. He still rain on the yes, yes, yes. just as well as the unjust. Yes, 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 yes. You're still receiving blessings, but you're not. You're, you're not receiving the, the, the same as what I would be receiving. Why? Because I'm his servant. Yes, sir. Jesus. Well, why, why do you say that? Because why? Because if you don't know Christ, you can't ask him for nothing. Yes, sir. Because there's an enemy between. There's a there's a brick wall between you and Christ. And he can't ask you because you're not his child. Mm. Yeah. Amen. And the only way he would ask you is that you are repenting yes, for your sins and asking to come in and save you. Yes. Then he will start blessing you yes. the way he blessed me. Yes. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 I'm talking to somebody, I, I, when last time I got sick, I was so sick. I was in the house, I, I vomited all night long. Mm. Amen. All night long, and kids got on and said, why did you call me? Well, I didn't call without that. I was in too much pain <laughs> call anybody. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. But when I went, my, my ship was up to over 600. Mm. And uh, well, I couldn't see, but you know what? After they, they, they loaded me up with insulin and all that for that first day because I was only in the observation ward. And once they get that sugar to drop, they're going to send you home. I said, well, you know, I don't know, all that, all that insulin they gave me, they had to come down. <laughs> I said, it, it ain't down yet. I said, it, they gonna go back up there tomorrow. I said, well, we can dismiss you today. <laughs> all right, so I got discharged, but the, the next day was back up there again. But, but my eyes were like, I can see better. You don't know what it is to be driving along, and you can't even see the street sign. <laughs> But I could see the car, but I couldn't make out. I knew the shape of the stop sign. I knew when to stop. I knew when to do ups and so. But, but you know what I like about God? God gave me back my sight better than what it was before. Would always be up sometimes at 140, 150, but 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 now now it's down to 93. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. My pressure is fired. Why? Because I submit myself to God. I said, Lord, if it's your will, whatever it is, I, you know, I accept it. Glory. Yeah. Amen. If I perish, I perish. But Lord, I'm going to do your will at whatever price that it costs me. Yeah. I'm going to still serve you. Yeah. And God said, not yet. Mm. Thank you, Lord. I'm going to send you back down there to love you. got something else to do. Go. So my grace is still, my grace is with you. Go. Amen. 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 
Amen. And, and, and I'm seeing good, I'm walking good, but I tell you, I feel so much different. Glory. Amen. Yes. You know what? It was great. Right. Not, not, not what I was doing. It's the, it's the confidence that I had in the one that I was serving. Yes. If you want something from God, you got to serve him. And God said, just like the unjust judge did thus and so, how much more would I give you? Glory. Amen. That's what bread ain't gonna give you a serpent. He will bless you. Yes. Don't you want a blessing from yes. God? Yes. How is your servant? Mm. And not only now, you say, well, I'm serving God. If you're serving God, then how is your serving to one another? Oh. Oh well, I'm serving God. I don't have I don't have to serve you. I don't I don't have to like this person. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Glory. <laughs> God said, you if you don't love your fellow man like you love yourself, you can't love me. Yes, sir. And you can't ask nothing from me either. Because mm. if you ask something from me and you don't like your brother, he said, I ain't gonna give you nothing. <laughs> huh? Isn't that something? Yes, sir. See, nobody, no, nobody likes confusion in their family. Amen. Amen. I remember when we were young and if something go wrong in the family or the brother get into a little fight with one another, first thing mom would do is call us together and say, come here. Uh, what I want you to do now, 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 you, I want you to hug it. Mm -hmm. Lord, have mercy. <laughs> <laughs> that was the hardest thing yes, to do. But do you not know after you hug all that old anger just seemed to disappear? Amen. Do you know that? Amen. When you said I'm sorry and you embrace one another, all of that anger, all of that bitterness will disappear. Yeah. Amen. But it takes your affection. It takes you embracing one another. Amen. No, you want to stay there. <laughs> I ain't gonna have nothing else to do with it. <laughs> you got nothing else to do with nobody, you just better be careful because mm. you just just blotted out your joy. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 I'm coming in. Do you want to blot out your joy? Or do you want to just be do you want to be a servant? Yes, sir. Amen. Can we serve one another? Can you esteem one another higher than yourself? Yeah. Oh, amen. No, can you stop the hypocrisy that's going on in, in God's house among one another? I told somebody one time, you know, we talk about love. We go, oh, brother, you know I love you. Inside, you're gritting your teeth. That's the biggest lie. <laughs> Church folk tell that. <laughs> Amen. Not, 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 you can't blame the world because the world will fight you right now and then after a while, hey man, let's make up. <laughs> Church people don't make up. <laughs> <laughs> you want somebody to get depression, you want somebody to take your name out in the street and smear it? Oh. Christian folk. <laughs> oh, y'all don't want to hear that. <laughs> Go back down to the dumps again. 
But when the Holy Spirit is ushered in, yes, yes. amen, when service is over, yes. glory, you're still going to talk about it. You're going to talk about it on up until next week. Until the next time you have service, you're going to rejoice. You're going to make phone calls. You're going to tell everybody how, how God has blessed your soul. Thank you, Lord. That's when you let the Holy Spirit do what he's going to do. Yes, sir. Now, in this, the Holy Spirit has been trying to come in, but we ushered it out. Yes. Amen. Yes. We got all our own self wrapped up, tied up. Amen. It's what the person is saying about me. It's what, it's what I think about the other person. But yet, we come in and we want to sing together. We can't even pray together. We can't even sit together. Amen. Lord have mercy. Sit there and you're all on pins and needles. If you have to sit on the same row with somebody you don't like, oh boy. Amen. I'm coming. God bless you. May heaven smile upon you. I'm sorry if I bothered you. I just said that. I don't know. I don't apologize for nothing. <laughs> that I said, say in the pulpit. Amen. I know I preached one time in a funeral. One of the relatives didn't like what I said. He came to me after the service and said, I want you to go back and apologize. Well, right away I looked at him and said, do you want to know one thing? He said, what? I don't apologize for nothing I said in the pulpit. If I said it, the Holy Spirit directed me to say it, and there's no apology. Amen. Amen. So you do what you got to do, and I'll do what I got to do. <laughs> Amen. Yes. So you can't we, preach the truth is going to cost you. Yes, sir. Amen. Yes. People ain't going to like when you preach the truth. Yes. Yes. Amen. Yes, yes. But I, I said, you know, I'm not, I'm not a bonded man, but I ain't going to stand there and let you knock me out. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Amen. Yes, sir. But I do know how to handle myself. <laughs> you see, God didn't call no chicken. Everybody, everybody, everybody got oh, called. Some, some of them have been out there and they know how to defend themselves. Amen. 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 But we, I'm past that now. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. If I did wrong, I might take a blow if I did wrong. I accept that. You just hit me one time. God bless you. May heaven's father put you. Amen. I'm glad to be here.